Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix escape from the cop game not launching, crashing, not loading, lagging, low FPS, black screen or other issues on PC. So let's go through the methods. So the first method is to check system requirements. For that, go to Steam. Now search the game in the search bar and then go below. And here you can check the system requirements to play the game on your system and make sure you have all these requirements. And after that, try to launch the game. Next is to verify integrity of game files for that launch team. Now go to the library section here. I am showing you an example. Uh, after selecting the game, right click on it. Click on properties. Now click on install files and then click on verify integrity of game files. So after verifying the game files, now check if you can play the game. Next solution is to update graphics card for that. Go to the Windows search over here. Search for device manager. Now expand display adapter select your graphics card right click on it click on update driver and then click on search automatically for drivers so this will search for the update if there is available on your driver and after updating your drivers now check if you can launch the game nvidia and amd users go through the link i have already provided in the description and you can easily update your graphics card from there next method is to modify launch option for that go to uh, steam under library section select your game right click on it click on properties now under general here you have to type minus dx11 and then try to launch the game and see if it's working if not again come back type minus dx12 and then check if the game is working properly now next method is to disable in-game overlays for that go to steam now click on steam option then click on settings go below click on in-game and here enable the steam overlay while in game option if it is enabled you have to disable it by clicking on it after disabling it now launch the game and see if you can play it Next solution is to disable antivirus program or firewall. So if you are having an antivirus program that then it can interrupt in your gameplay and can lead to such kind of issues. So what you do is uh, go to the Windows search, search for Windows security. And after that, click on virus and threat protection. Now go below, click on manage settings and here real time protection. You can see it's turned off in my case. If it is turned on then you have to simply turn it off and then check if the problem is fixed after that go uh, here and search for windows defender firewall then click on turn windows defender firewall on or off and here in the private network and public network you have to here in the private network settings and public network settings you have to click on turn off windows defender and then click on ok and then try to play the game and see if it's working if not again come back or uh, disable all this click on uh, turn on windows uh, defender firewall and in the public and private network settings and then click on ok and after that try to launch the game and see if it's working now next is to allow the game through firewall for that go to the windows search search for windows security now click on firewall and network protection then click on allow an app through firewall then click on change settings now here search for the game if it's listed if not click on allow another app and click on browse then go to the game folder select your game application add it to the list over here now after uh, selecting it make sure both private and public boxes are ticked then click on ok after this launch the game and see if it's working or not next is to run the game as administrator for that launch team go to the uh, game select your game right click on it click on manage then click on browse local files this will take you to the game folder where it has been installed now search for the game application right click on it click on properties click on compatibility then here select on this program as an administrator then hit on hit on apply and ok and after that check if the issue is fixed if not select disable full screen optimizations then click on apply and ok and after that check if you can play the game Next solution is to increase virtual memory settings. So for that, go to the Windows search, search for View Advanced System Settings. Now click on Settings, click on Advanced, and click on Change. Here you have to select the drive where your game has been installed. Now select Custom. Here you have to type one double two double H, and in the maximum size you have to type two four five seven six, and then click on Set, and then click on OK. After doing this, check if uh, the game is working now. Next is to update Windows. For that, go to the Windows search, search for check for updates. Now, here you have to 
click on check for updates and it will check if there is any update available and after updating your windows try to launch the game again and see if it's working next is to update system bios so for that check your motherboard model then now visit its support page and download the latest bios after that follow the official instructions for bios flashing and finally restart your system and then test the game if it's launching or not next is to close unnecessary background processes for that go to windows search, search for task manager here you have to search for those apps which are of no use uh, but running in the background now after searching them select it right click on it and click on end task so after doing all these settings now check if you can play the game next method is to install visual c++ files for that i have already provided the link in the description just copy this link and paste it in your browser or otherwise you can search for visual c++ files on your browser so go below and from here you have to click on the link it will be downloaded and after downloading install them and after installing restart your pc and then log into the game and check if you can play it without any further problem the final solution is to reinstall the game for that go to steam under library section select your game right click on it click on manage then click on uninstall and finally click on uninstall option so after uninstalling the game now uh, restart your pc after restarting again launch steam and then reinstall re escape from duck of game on your pc and after that click on the play button and check if you can play it without any kind of errors or issues so that's all for now in this video thank you